The Oceanico Group Pro-Am Challenge at the Marriott Worsley Park Hotel and Country Club was the latest stop for the Challenge Tour. Opening rounds of 63, 64 and 67 saw Rafael D'Souza move into the final round at the top of the leaderboard with a 16 under total, one clear of the field. His nearest challenger was Alessandro Tadini, and as D'Souza faltered over the front nine, Tadini made his move. Out in 33, 17 under for the tournament, three clear of D'Souza. Klaus Eriksson now came into the equation. He matched Tadini's front nine of 33 and finally signed for a closing round of 66, 14 under in the clubhouse. Birdies at 16 and 17 moved D'Souza back into contention on 15 under par. And with Tadini struggling to make par at the last to protect his 17 under par score, the closing birdie for the Swiss player would really stretch the Italian's nerves. A par finish saw D'Souza on 15 under par. And that meant Tadini could take the luxury of a bogey at the last to win by a shot. His 16 under par total good enough to register his first win since he won the Costa Rican Open in 2004. Alessandro Tadini, the Oceanico Group Prime Challenge champion. Big smile. Okay, <laughs>